Thank you. 
up, dude. transfer student. As you all know, this is our third. And that makes it a hat trick. Please, introduce yourself. My name is Ryoji Mochizuki. I would be grateful if you could show me the ropes. <laughs> hey, this kind of cute. I was thinking the same thing. <laughs> Not so loud. Nice to meet you. Ryoji lived overseas for a long time because of his parents' work. So he may not be used to all of our customs. Be sure to explain them to him. Now then, you need a seat. Let's see. But that one's open. Second from the left in the front. Um, Miss Toriyumi, technically that seat's taken. You must be present to be a member of this class, so as far as I'm concerned, that seat is available. Life is nothing but a game of musical chairs. The rest of you should be careful too. Good morning. I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name. You are dangerous. Dangerous? I haven't even asked you out on a date yet. A date? Mm -hmm. I guess, what's wrong with you? <laughs> Rejected from the start. You're an interesting girl. Your teacher understands, I guess. You haven't had very long to be the new student, and already you have to share the spotlight. I wish your classmates would pay attention to me for a change. Hey, are any of you even listening?
up, dude? Greetings. Oh, 
Greetings.
What's up, dude? Gekukan High School, a place of learning. It comes as quite a shock that such a warm, luminous place transforms into Tartarus each night. Hmm, what should I do? Everyone here seems to be wearing a predetermined uniform. I may draw too much attention to myself. I hope this won't pose a problem. Understood. I shall heed your advice. Now then, excuse me as I make myself less conspicuous. If I stay hidden from view this way, there will be nothing to worry about. and into the school. This is a surprise to find a bastion of commerce inside a house of learning. Could you please wait here for a moment? There's something I've been curious about for a while. Excuse me, I'd like to purchase a school lunch. Oh, yes? They don't handle those here. How disappointing. I would have liked to taste these school lunches in their native environment. I suppose I can settle for bread. I've heard that having bread for lunch can be a pleasure in itself. Now that we're done here, I'd like to see your home room. So many 
desks and students with such a limited amount of space between them. But perhaps... Yes, I see. It's designed this way to foster a sense of harmony with others. I can feel the careful thought and foresight from whoever arranged things this way. This observation post must be what they call a podium. I see. Standing behind it does cause a longing to teach to well up inside of me. First question. Diet food or super diet food? Which is tastier? That is incorrect. As a penalty for giving the wrong answer, you will receive your own portion of diet food. Is this what a classroom lecture is like? <laughs> I'm feeling rather uneasy with so many eyes on me. So let us move on with the tour. entirely understand my own motives in wanting to come here. But while walking so closely beside you, I... How should I express this? I felt very fulfilled. Perhaps what I really wanted to learn at school was more about you. But why? In any case, discovering the reasons behind this desire should provide an intriguing diversion for me.
There you are. I've been looking for you. It's rare for you to miss a student council meeting. I take it someone asked you to find me? Well, yeah, even though I'm not a member. Sorry about that. They seem pretty busy with the class trip and all. I bet you have your hands full since it's both for juniors and seniors. Huh. The class trip, huh? Even if I went, I'd only spoil the fun. You're not thinking of skipping the trip, are you? <sighs> you can't do that. You know, I've been meaning to talk to you. Is that so? To tell you the truth, you're not the easiest person to relate to. But I know what it's like to lose a father. Talking about. I decided that I should be more upfront with you from now on. Ah, there she is. Hey there, ladies. I've been looking everywhere for you. Ryoji kun, why are you here? Huh? Same as you. I was trying to find Mitsuru senpai. Some girl I've never met before asked me to look for her. What? I wasn't the only one she asked, either. She said if we don't find her, the class trip might get cancelled. Seems like the vice president has the whole school looking for you. But I'm the lucky one who found you, Mitsuru Kirijo. You're quite stunning, if I may say so. Would you like to go out sometime? I know this one restaurant. It's on the top floor of a three-star hotel. The view at night is almost as breathtaking as you. Huh? Senpai, you better get back to the meeting! I... I suppose so. Takeba, thank you for your concern. For now, I will attend to my duties. Hey, she didn't answer my question. For now, huh? I don't like the sound of that. Um, Yukari-san, how about you? Would you like to join me for dinner? I know this place on Shirakawa Boulevard. Ow!
Welcome back. Yeah. 
lab did. Put you in.